Darren Drager, I, I have to bring this up. And uh, a lot of people don't like that. I will say this, though. If there is one area where Pat Kane is going to be loved in Buffalo, you're sitting in it right now. It would be Imperial Pizza. Yeah, you want to, <laughs> Imperial he brought the pizza. cup here, man. He grew up around here. He brought the cup here. Yeah, yeah, he did. Yeah. He brought the cup here. There's uh, there's a jerseys of a lot of players here, but there's multiple Pat Kane jerseys. So I better kind of whisper this. If there's going to be any King or slander, I better whisper it here in Imperial. All right. I might get my ass whooped <laughs> at this place. But on a serious note, Darren Drager uh, tweeted – today on thursday that he's continuing to rehab he had hip surgery he'll be out in at least another month and the one team he specifically said in his tweet that has reported interest in kane is the sabers the buffalo sabers um goes without saying the hometown kid i, I get it to that extent but i really don't think kevin adams or terry bridgula really care about that shit did that surprise you to hear that the sabers reportedly according to drager at least have interest in kane do you see if he were to come here, like what kind of fit would he be? We kind of already got in a pretty good gauge of what the fan reaction is. Although if he became a Sabre, I think that would change pretty quick. What's your thoughts on that? So I think the Sabres are looking at every option. They're having every conversation. And they should, they're, right? Yeah, they're, they're in that position to have every conversation. Yeah. Um, personally, I don't like, here's the thing. I think I didn't see this, by the way. This is the first I'm hearing about it. Did I oh, yeah. right from work? Walked the dogs, came and plowed through, Having a life. plowed through wings with you. <laughs> um, I love it. I love it. And yeah. I bet you everyone hates it. Because I think that there's this thought that he's going to get – we don't know what the money's going to be. It's all about the money. Um, but, like, a guy that has that experience, has cups, it's not about the – Buffalo. I don't, I don't care about the Buffalo thing. I yeah, just think, I don't I think he's, still, he's still a really good player. Is he still a really good player? I'm at, I'm not being sarcastic. I'm asking you, you know, dead serious. I, yeah. I don't know. Yeah, he's still a really good player. He's, he's still a good player. So I, I mean, the pulse on Twitter today, and again, whatever you know how Twitter is. It can of be, course, I do. It can be useful, but it can be a big ass yeah. cesspool. We talk about that shit all the time. But the pulse on Twitter today was not favorable towards from fans towards Pat Kane coming here again. Mm -hmm. I really don't think Kevin Adams is looking at fans tweets and saying, "Oh, you know what? We don't want this guy." What's anymore. the money? What's the money? I mean, I think that matters. What's his role? Let's just pretend for the sake of discussion, Chris, that the Sabres are interested in, and he wants to be here. What, what's his role? Well, first of all, the Sabres are going to have some injuries. I worry about some of these players in the, on the forward ranks. I think, you know, Alex Tuck isn't old by any means, but he's got a lot of wear and tear, man. Like, mm -hmm. what happens if he goes down? Well, there's Kane's role. Okay. Very true. Um, Good you know, point. Good point. Just what are we talking about with, you know, Cousins, like with Quinn being out? I mean, man, could you imagine Kane out there with, like, Cousins and uh, Paterka? I think that'd be fun. But, no, I his role is kind of like look at it with Eric Johnson coming in the team, a guy that's been there, done that. He's still a, one of the youngest, I think the youngest team in yeah. the NHL. His role is experience. His role is offense. And I, I trust me, I understand Twitter. I get it. You know, and he had some bad press following him around for a long time we're not going to talk about that but it's like i'm not, uh, just hockey pure hockey some people don't want to let that shit go though that's well, kind of that's kind of the problem and uh the court of public opinion is the court of public opinion that's fine i'm not um i'm not even commenting on it. i'm saying from a hockey standpoint he's mm -hmm. still a good player and if the money's right i think it'd be really exciting he's still got some mileage left 